can't get myself centered here. Well, gang, it's me, Uncle Todd here, back at the theater. Yeah, it's cleared up, it was raining earlier. Here to see Men, directed by the man who directed Ex Machina. So, high hopes. Let's hope it lives up to its hype. See you after. Okay, well, got some mixed feelings about it. Uh, the basic story, I don't want to give too much away, is uh, this uh, woman who recently lost her husband goes to this little village, uh, this is set in England, uh, to grieve and uh, deal with feelings of guilt and anger and, and all the things that come with that. And uh, things just start to get weird. There's this naked guy that keeps showing up. And all the uh, people she meets, uh, they start out okay. And then they get kind of creepy. And uh, it's very slow moving for the first uh, hour. And then things start to ramp up. And things start to get weirder and weirder and weirder. Uh, kind of reminds me a bit of Annihilation, only unlike with Annihilation, where uh, that had a bit of uh, a rather satisfactory ending uh, without, you know, explaining everything. This is kind of anticlimactic and uh, ambiguous when you get to the end. Uh, it... Uh, after the first hour, it does start to get a bit grisly. So, gore fans will probably enjoy that part of it. Um, it's all a bit allegorical, to be honest. Uh, and at a certain point, um, you kind of figure out where it's going. But again, it's a bit of an ambiguous uh, ending, so... Even that is, is a little disappointing. But up till then, uh, it is a very well-made and very suspenseful. Uh, the acting's all really good. And uh, uh, all in all, it was okay. Uh, don't, I don't think it was great, but it wasn't awful. Uh, but if you like really weird things that kind of play with your head and things just get really crazy you might like it but be warned uh, if you're into jump scares not really going to get any and uh oh, put my finger in the middle of the camera again i do that a lot uh but uh that's about all i have to say about this one